Welcome to Lagos, a hidden gem in Algarve region of Portugal. In this video, I'm going to take you through the top 5 things you absolutely must experience in Lagos. Lagos is known for its beaches, and they are the main reason you should visit this incredible coastal paradise. Two of the most popular ones are Camilo and Dona Ana Beach. Camilo is a morning dream, while Dona Ana is the perfect spot for the water sports enthusiasts. But if you're like us and just want to swim and soak up the sun all day, Maya Beach is your go-to spot. You can rent a sunbed and umbrella for 15 euros or simply bring your own and enjoy the endless stretch of crystal clear waters. We were lucky during our September visit, the ocean was calm, making swimming an absolute delight. What sets Algarve apart are its dramatic cliffs and you can take in breathtaking views from Camilla Beach, although you will need to conquer quite a few steps to reach it. Dona Ana Beach is another game surrounded by these majestic cliffs. Our personal favorite was around Marinia Beach, where you can take a 10 minute hike to witness natural arch that, when viewed from the right angle, resemble a heart. It's also incredibly close to the famous Benegal Cave, and you will see adventurous kayakers paddling beneath these arches. Now, let's talk about the most crucial part of any trip, the food. Before your trip, make reservations because the top places tend to have long queues or be fully booked. Lesson learned. Always make a reservation or be prepared to discover the next best place. We had delicious dinner, house wine and amazing time at Mangi Tapas Bar. For seafood lovers, Continua Algarve is a must visit, although it can get pretty busy. If you're flexible enough to sit inside, you might snag a spot faster. Elmer had octopus and I ordered cod with passion fruit sauce. Another memorable dining experience was at Com Espinas, where every tapas dish was a culinary delight. Their shrimp was simply amazing. We ordered all the tapas and we ordered them again to enjoy with the housewife. And the best piri piri chicken? Look no further than Churrasquera Marca de Jalvor. It's the only place we willingly waited in line and it was worth it. Piri piri, salad, sardinas and house wine. Everything was delicious. We lucked out with our visit date as August 29th marked an important historical event known as Festa de Banho, the Festival of Bath. At noon, we witnessed elderly locals reenacting the tradition of swimming in the ocean on this day, believed to equal 29 baths and ward of demons. In the afternoon, we strolled through the charming streets of Lagos, admiring the local architecture and exploring souvenir shops. In the evening, festivities continued for all ages. So, if you're in the area, make sure to explore the city during the daylight and immerse yourself in the local culture. Saving the best for last, experiencing the sunset at Punta de Piedade is a must-do in Algarve. Arrive at least an hour before the sunset to wander around the platforms and enjoy the breathtaking views. Hundreds of people gather here for this magical moment every day, so arriving early ensures an intimate spot to savor this unique experience. We spent only three days in Lagos, yet it made us to fall in love with its mesmerizing beaches and cliffs, delicious cuisine and cultural celebrations. Don't miss out on any of these top 5 things to do when you visit this destination. Subscribe to our channel to not miss the coming adventures. Happy travels!